are going to face a pandemic in our lifetime but i feel so helpless at times you know when the patients are struggling so much and uh, we try our best to uh, do whatever we can uh, but sometimes patients are doing really well and they suddenly become sick we have nothing to do but uh, to reassure them yeah, that yes they'll come out of it and apart from that there are also a group of patients who are getting better and going home so that is kind of encouragement for us and for the other patients as well these patients are alone there are no attendants with them so they are dependent on every single thing on us be it their medications be it their day to day life activities but yes i carry a lot of responsibility and i have to overcome it it's a great responsibility and challenging situation to be frontline workers during this pandemic due to long working hours and stress i feel proud and privileged to be a nurse since visitors are restricted in covid areas we nurses spend most of the time with covid-19 patients hence i tell all the recovered covid-19 stories to patients and my own story how i recovered to be strong than the virus to build hope and give reassurance to them it starts with your hands hence wash your hands frequently follow safe distance wear mask if you are unwell stay home and isolated and follow your doctor's instructions get yourself vaccinated it was really a hard time for me to work in a pandemic situation with a pp mask it was really tough and after that i don't know how i have overcome it because i thought that the losing of hope is not work in this pandemic so i have to take a remedy for that so i started to keep all my things in a positive way in a enthusiastic way and i i reached my patient it was came it worked up more dealing with the patient is the next task it was really a big task for me because patients will come in a such a situation they will lose their hope they will be alone they will be staying away from them so next task is to feel them secure and more comfortable in the ward where we are so i used to communicate with the patient every 10 to 15 minutes which all the times which are free and i used to hear their problems and i used to share their feelings what they are feeling towards the covid i used to give a comfort to them when they are not feeling well after that i used to give i, I make them to call their family and talk them well when they are in the ward after that at the end of the call they will say that i am okay i am feeling comfortable here i can say that this pandemic is not going to decrease but the only thing we can do is wear a mask do hand hygiene and keep a social distancing at least 6 meter away from a person to person stay safe stay healthy a day had come when we had to merge with the covid ward to meet the needs of the society and that is the time the team of nurses without any much hesitation have come hand in hand to work together to fight this battle even the budding nurses have stood with us under the guidance and supervision of the seniors it's very difficult for us to wear the ppe and work for long hours to leave our loved ones and stay but still it gives us a lot of satisfaction this is the time where we are working together globally to fight for the single cause and yes we will win this battle at this time i would like to pray to god almighty to give us the power and the strength to work for this cause and win this battle i had been tested positive but i have not lost hope i will come back to fight this battle what is to be a nurse in this profession well i would say it is rather difficult to be a nurse in this profession because this uh, pandemic has hit us so hard like tsunami and we have to work for 8 to 10 hours a day without going for breaks in between no washrooms but sometimes we feel kind of proud and blessed that we are able to contribute for our country and for the people during their times of need and our families are also worried about us but uh, 
while others are there with their loved ones at home taking care during their times of need, here we are at the hospital taking care of the sick and needy. But still, we this is a war zone and we are we have to overcome it. I feel very much proud to be a nurse in this pandemic as it's a very big challenge for all of us as we are frontline health workers. I feel like I'm a soldier who is facing a war. I interact with the patient normally as the other patient. Like I think that if I will be normal with the patient, the automatically the patient will normal. This is the this is the big hope that I can give to the patient. The message that I can give to the viewers that it's not the responsibility of a doctor or a nurse. It's all of all of individual responsibility to maintain social distance, take proper vaccine, wear a mask, and wash your hand. The world woke up in 2020 to a new disease called as COVID-19, initially declared as a medical emergency and later been told as a pandemic. It came to each one of us as a nightmare. Wearing of PPEs and masks was really exhausting and horrifying. To see our colleagues infected, their loved ones being lost was really distressing and disturbing. Overcrowded ICUs, abruptly changing policies in the hospital, list of patients waiting for beds, losing of loved ones, all that was a painful plight to see. Care became very difficult and different. It was just a nurse to take care of the patient. Even at the point of death, the loved ones could not be bid a final goodbye. Sometimes and every time people tell that it is the community to be prepared, but we realize that it is necessary to be self-motivated and inspired in order to fight this plight. I feel proud that I am able to serve community during this pandemic. Though it is exhausting, we get tired at the end of the shift. But there is a great sense of satisfaction since we touch lots of lives. It's extremely challenging to deal with elderly patients and anxious family members. Uh, pro and uh, most probably providing psychological support is extremely important to ease their worries and make them feel comfortable. We give reassurance and uh, take care of all their needs wholeheartedly which give them hope. My message to all is to stay calm and composed and let us fight against this virus. I stay at work for you, you stay at home for us. Nurses, the guiding angels, selfless unsung heroes working during this pandemic. Interaction with patients have always been the main forty for nurses to establish their professional bond, to understand their feelings and to render empathetic care. What else a person in agony and fear of unknown will ever want? when their near and dear ones are away from them. They always see people around them with the mask faces and with the wrapped PPE kit. A warm professional touch, assurance, sympathy. More than caring and treating the patient physically with the medication, a nurse heals them emotionally and mentally like a guiding angel. We have always had to have the belief, the conviction that there is a better life the better world beyond the horizon. We all know we are finding ourselves in uncertain times, but we cannot fall apart. We are fighting this battle together to make this world a better place to live in. So as a responsible citizen, let us help sail through this difficult time by maintaining strict adherence to safety protocols. Here is something we all need to do. Keep calm and do not panic because panic causes fear losing our confidence. Get vaccinated at the earliest. Do not neglect symptoms and get tested as early as possible. Stay home, step out if necessary. If detected positive, follow self-isolation protocols and let's be introvert for some time by keeping safe distance. It is always better to wear a mask than an oxygen mask. Remember, clean space, safe space. So wash your hands regularly and follow cuff etiquette. Follow health advices from reliable sources and avoid spreading rumors. And moreover, be kind to each other and let kindness fill this earth and not the virus. If each one is doing their duty, we can preserve the beauty of this earth. Stay safe, stay healthy. Uh everything was going fine then suddenly this pandemic was declared last year so nobody was wise enough to take uh, i mean deal this pandemic and uh, everybody was scared being a healthcare providers we were also scared and uh, then i thought uh, that god has chosen us and i i i'm blessed that i am in this profession so i so i should take care of my patients in the beginning we all were scared but 
always the thing which boosted me was that it it is god's task i should perform it and i should utilize my skills to take care of my patients uh, so uh, so this uh, this kind of uh, thinking always helped me and uh, being a nurse it is all everybody's responsibility and we all must remember that we will uh, we shall overcome we will we will fight this uh, we will fight and we will this we will uh, fight against this pandemic and uh, we will surely win if we will not lose our hope we will uh, be together we will be performing for our patients we will give quality care to our patients as a Thank nurse working in pandemic initially i was skeptical about this pandemic and the situation arising but as the days have passed by i feel i have learned to cope up with this new normal and how made it a point that i meet all my patient needs this pandemic has made me stronger in clinical management awareness and knowledge exchange we continuously educate the patient on diet exercise medication for better cooperation reinforce to keep themselves calm and cool we encourage patient to give hope and constant support to each other and share their experience for their well being i have a message for all the people across the country kindly do not panic thing will improve with time compulsory hand hygiene social distancing and mask at all time is very crucial to be followed we are there for you stay safe stay strong I believe that nurses have critical roles and responsibilities during the COVID-19 pandemic. Actually, we will continue to be at the front line of patient care in hospital and actively involved with the education and monitoring in the community. We have to ensure that all patients acquire personalized, high-quality services irrespective of their infectious condition. A global pandemic needs a strong nursing staff engagement. in clinical management awareness knowledge and exchange and public safety as a nurse we are at front line of covid-19 outbreak responses and are exposed to hazards that put ourselves at risk of infection it is vital that we are supported to protect ourselves with specific infection prevention measures and sufficient provision of protective gear at their practice i know it is very tough But we work for six to eight hours continuously uh, in PPE kit. As nurses, we are bearing the pain not only for our job, also to protect our world against the COVID-19 virus infection. So I would proudly say that I am a frontline warrior against COVID-19, and I would like to the greater greatest opportunity to take care of patients. And it is the responsibility of the society to stay safe at home. and follow hand hygiene social distance and face mask